In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can turn on BitLocker in your Windows 8. So, uh, to get started, I've already connected a USB drive to my computer. And then, the next step is we go to uh, your desktop and you go to uh, in the left, in the bottom of your screen where your start icon, start screen icon uh, or thumbnail showing. And then you're going to right click it and you see you can have many uh, access here, for example, like File Explorer. So we're going to select File Explorer and click it once. And we are now in our File Explorer. For example, I want to protect this uh, F hard drive, so I'm going just to click it. And here on the top, you see Drive Tools, and then click on Manage and BitLocker, and then click on Arrow and turn BitLocker on. So, um, here I have uh, this kind of error and if you have this tool you just hit cancel and then the next go again to your left uh, very left bottom corner of your screen and hover it then you see start screen thumbnail you're going to right click it again and go to control panel here in the control panel search box you're going to type in a uh, group policy so here it is in edit group policy, just click on that. And here you go to administrative templates on the arrow. Just click it to see what's inside. And here go to Windows component. And here go to BitLocker drive encryption. And then click on operating system drives. In the right side, you're going to see require additional authentication at startup. Click that once and then right click and edit. Here by default is not configured, so we're going to enable it by clicking enabled. And then it will be configured for you. And then going to click apply and hit OK. So close all the windows and go back to your um, drive again. That you select the drive that you want to protect. Go to BitLocker small arrow there and turn BitLocker on. Now it's configured for us. And then here you're going to choose how you want to unlock your hard drive at startup. You're going to insert a USB flash drive or enter a password. In this case I want to enter a password. So I'm going to click that and here I want to enter my password. And then again the same password and hit next. And here, how do you want to back up your recovery key? So, uh, you can choose one of these, but uh, I recommend that you print the recovery key or save the USB flash drive. At the moment, I've already my USB drive connected, so I'm going to hit save to USB flash drive. And here it shows what kind of USB drive you have connected. And this is mine. I'm just going to save it here click save and hit next and if your computer is kind of new you can then choose the faster way or if you want you can also uh, clicking the slower that uh, you have already a lot of files in your drive but for this demo just to make the time runs faster I'm going to uh, choose default setting and then hit next and then hit continue and it will then show you that uh, it has to be restarted. So let's restart our computer and I will be back very soon. So I'll see you soon guys. So there it is. Now I'm restarting my computer and it will uh, be restarted very soon. Now as you can see I'm asked to enter my password which I entered earlier in BitLocker um, dialog box and now I'm entering it. and hit enter. So there it is guys, now we are in start screen. So thank you for watching and take care. Goodbye.